Ladies and gentlemen, please rise and welcome the College of Arts and Letters Platform Party. Ladies and gentlemen, the IA O'Shaughnessy, Dean of the College of Arts and Letters and Professor of Sociology, Sarah Mastillo. Please be seated. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. The deans, faculty, and registrar of the University of Notre Dame would like to welcome you to this joyous celebration of the distribution of evidence of the conferral of the degrees by Father Jenkins this morning. It is my honor to ask the faculty to please rise. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming the faculty of the College of Arts and Letters. Thank you, please be seated. It is my honor to ask the Arts and Letters graduating students to rise. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome this year's graduates. You. Please be seated. I would like to now introduce the other members of the platform party. 
I invite each member to stand as I read your name, please. Behind me is Vice President, Vice President and Associate Provost Hugh Page. <laughs> to his left, the Associate Dean for Undergraduate Studies, Mary Flannery. <laughs> Assistant Dean, Colin Meisner. <laughs> Assistant Dean, Nicholas Russo. <laughs> Assistant Dean, Mary O'Callaghan. <laughs> Assistant Dean, Darlene Hampton. <laughs> Assistant Dean, Maureen Dawson. Assistant Dean Joseph Stanfield. Please be seated. Before the invocation, I have four quick announcements. First, you may follow the sequence of this ceremony by turning to page 45 in your commencement weekend program. Second, the ceremony is being streamed so that you can see the images on the jumbotron above. Third, as you will notice, we have a professional photographer to capture the diploma moment. The company is called Brad Images. They will contact you by email uh, or by mail soon after this event today. And finally, students, please know that you do not need to wear your mask while taking a picture uh, as you make your way across the platform or when taking pictures at the bottom of the ramp after you receive your diploma. With that, I now call on Vice President and Associate Provost for Undergraduate Affairs, Hugh Page, to give the invocation. And I ask you to remain standing after the invocation for the National Anthem. Please stand. Let us pray. We give you thanks, O oh God, for this day of celebration. We are grateful for the many accomplishments of this graduating class and for the families, friends, faculty, staff, and mentors that have supported them along the way. We are mindful of the many sacrifices made and the aspirational seeds planted, cultivated, and now brought to fruition this weekend. Bless all that are joining us for this ceremony physically, virtually, or in spirit. Link us heart to heart, soul to soul, with those about to cross this stage in recognition of the degrees they have earned. Grant them the insight and resolve needed to apply what they have learned in becoming the prophets of hope, the dreamers, the activists, the truth tellers, and the peacemakers that our country and our world so desperately need. Give us the grace, give us the courage to join them in the crucial endeavors to which they are called and to become devotees of that all-encompassing love in whose presence hatred may not stand, from whose wellsprings hope is nurtured and through which all things are possible. Amen.
Please be seated. Okay, most commencement remarks start with some sort of tally of the things you've learned or gained over the past four years. Critical thinking, articulate writing, an appreciation for other cultures, and so forth. Then they might move into talking about how your college education has prepared you for the jobs you're about to start or the professional or graduate schools you're about to attend. The really deep and reflective speeches may end with something about how your education isn't just preparing you for a job, but is indeed preparing you for life. You know what? It's been a long year and it's a hot day. Let's just skip all that. And why should we skip it? Because you know it. You've been hearing it from us and you've lived it. You heard it from us at the very first event you attended for accepted students in the spring before your first year. And then you heard it again at Welcome Weekend and JPW. It's blasted all over the halls of O'Shaughnessy. Study everything, do anything. 97% placement rate. You've lived it. I trust that you know in your hearts what you've gained and what you've earned at Notre Dame. So let's not belabor those points. That we are here together today demonstrates that you have what it takes to be successful in the world. You've made it through four years of rigorous coursework filled with late nights and long papers, often while working, playing a sport, conducting research, doing service, or all of the above. You've also made it through the sudden campus shutdown last year, having your study abroad experiences cut short, dealing with dual delivery classes, quarantine, isolation, surveillance testing, masks, and all of the additional stress and fear that came with living through the pandemic this year. The senior year was very different than the one you all envisioned. And you didn't choose this, none of us did. But you did it. You persevered, individually and as a community. Today we celebrate your success together with brighter days on the horizon. You're graduating. You should be immensely proud of your accomplishments. I am. I'm a big fan of data, and I would say at this point, we have enough data on all of you to be confident that you're gonna be successful. In this stadium today, we have a dozen Fulbright winners, a Truman Scholar, a Luce Scholar, two Boren Scholars, 10 Gilman Scholars, and several Rhodes and Marshall finalists. We have students like Patrick McCabe, a political science and Arabic major who won a prestigious Truman Scholarship for the nation's top students interested in public service careers. Patrick, whose grandparents were exiled from Cuba in the 1960s, is passionate about refugee issues. During his time at Notre Dame, he studied in Jordan and conducted research with and volunteered for refugee organizations in Morocco, Chile, and Jerusalem. Patrick plans to pursue a career in diplomacy in the Middle East and North Africa, and he is headed to the State Department after graduation. Patrick, I'm confident that you're gonna be a force for good in the world. We have students like Dane Kim. We have students like Dane Kim, a psychology and statistics major, who four years ago traveled from Korea to South Bend, having never set foot on Notre Dame's campus until Welcome Week. She didn't know anything about football or American slang, but her new friends and homemates quickly helped her adjust to, her, to life in her new home. But connections with Korean faculty, students, and clubs helped her stay rooted in her own culture. Through these experiences, as well as through internships and research projects, she cultivated a passion for diversity and inclusion. And now she's well prepared to start a new job at a web conferencing startup that breaks language and cultural barriers for people around the world. Dane, the world needs more people with your level of empathy and understanding. We have students like Veronica Mansour, an English and music major, who channeled her struggles with mental health into an entirely original musical she wrote, workshopped, and staged over the past year. Her goal of destigmatizing mental illness through music and art manifested in an exciting original production titled An Old Family Recipe that brought together students and faculty into a unique COVID-safe rehearsal and performance. 
As she pursues a graduate program in music and musical theater, she carries with her a talent for sparking important conversations through her creative work. Veronica, I can't wait to see your next musical. We have students like Diego Reynoso, a political science and economics major who grew up not far from here in Elkhart. His grandfather spent years working backbreaking hours picking fruit in California, and his parents worked at a factory where many of his family members and some of his best friends work. College never seemed possible, but he's walking across the stage today thanks to his relentless commitment and dedication and the years of hard work by his family to get him to this point. Diego instills the hope and promise of higher education in the local Latino youth he works with, helping them realize their true potential. He'll continue to inspire the next generation as he heads to Denver to teach middle school social studies through the Alliance for Catholic Education and then on to law school. Diego, your hard work and the hard work of your family paid off and the class of 2021 is lucky to have you as a member. And finally, we have students like Colleen Bontrager. Colleen experienced a severe head injury during her sophomore year that could have thrown her off course. But instead, she spent two years recovering from that injury, and her Notre Dame family has been there with her every step of the way. When she struggled with memory and concentration issues, her friends on campus spent hours going over material with her and studying with her, and her faculty members met with her regularly to offer help and support. Shortly after the injury, one of her friends suggested auditing a class so she could remember why she loved learning. She loved it so much she switched her major to psychology and has worked diligently since then to complete her recovery and to graduate on time, even adding a minor in gender studies. Now she's headed to Penn State to work at a psychology research lab and an inpatient recovery unit before pursuing graduate work in psychology. Colleen, you made it and you're an inspiration to us all. These are just a few of the many, many stories of our students. All of you have achieved success in your four years at Notre Dame, and your Notre Dame Arts and Letters education has prepared you for continued success across your lifetime. That your education here has prepared you for success probably isn't surprising. I'm quite sure it's what your parents expected when they sent you here. What may be more surprising is that in addition to preparing you for success, it has also prepared you for failure. Yes, here we are at the pinnacle of, of your life. We're gonna talk about failure for a few minutes. Mastillo's a real downer. The truth is, all of you are going to experience setbacks and failure in the future. For some, it might be work or financial. For others, it might be in family and other relationships. And still others, it might be a health problem. The good news is that in addition to preparing you for success, your Notre Dame Arts and Letters education has prepared you for failure in both instrumental and existential ways. When you experience setbacks, you'll have the confidence in yourself to get through it because you know that you can do hard things. When you experience failure, you'll have the humility, dignity, and empathy to understand other points of view, to draw from a deep wellspring of wisdom rooted in your Arts and Letters education, and the courage to learn from situations. When you experience hardships, you'll have the flexibility from your arts and letters education to recover, to pivot, and to find a new way. When you experience loss, you'll draw upon the entirety of your Notre Dame education, the expansion of your mind, your spirit, your soul, your community, and your love of God to find meaning in the loss. And when you struggle, you'll have the intellectual breadth, the frameworks of knowledge, and the authenticity to question the very notion of success to question the very notion of success. I'm sure most of you read uh, the Confessions by St. Augustine. St. Augustine documents the way his definition of success and failure changed during his life. When he was young, he defined success as worldly success, material success. I'm sure we can all relate to that. But Augustine talks about how he devoted so much time and attention uh, essentially to building his resume, his personal connections, professional connections, and his reputation, that he lost sight of the deeper meaning of life. He realized he was so focused on the material pursuits that his heart was empty. 
And that emptiness was a worse failure than any financial or professional failure he could have experienced. Augustine had a conversion experience, a moment of transformation that allowed him to become the best version of himself, the version God intended. Whether through reading St. Augustine or perhaps a, another course you took in your major, I hope that your arts and letters education has enlarged your heart, influenced your character, your values, and how you define success, whatever your faith stance, so that you are fully prepared to enrich the world with both your academic preparation and with your heart. I hope that your arts and letters education taught you that to succeed in life, to truly succeed, you need to share your strengths, your gifts, your talents with others. You need to give to others what you have, including what you've learned about yourself and about the world around you here at Notre Dame. To succeed, to truly succeed, we must be a people of integrity. And by that, I mean being a whole person, like a whole number, like an integer. There was a priest who used to be on the faculty here many years ago, around the time when I was a student, and he told a story of what he hopes his wake will be like when he died. Apparently, he was also a downer, too. Um, he said that when people are standing in line at his wake, when his neighbor is standing behind his doctor, who's standing behind a colleague or a student, he hopes that they're all talking about the same person. What I hope is that everyone you encounter knows you, the same you, because you're a person of integrity. What I want you to carry forward from Notre Dame is a sense that you're a whole person, an integer. You care about the truth, you seek to give yourself to others, and you're part of a family, the Notre Dame family. And that will be with you forever. What you received these past four years is only the beginning. The Notre Dame family, the same family that welcomed Patrick, Dane, Diego, and Veronica, and the same family that surrounded Colleen with comfort and strength, will be with you for a lifetime. Anywhere you go, anything you do, we will be there to support you, encourage you, and walk with you. When you leave here today, you become members of an alumni club, an exclusive club that will change your lives as much as these past four years have. Today, I get the privilege of welcoming you into that club. On behalf of my colleagues in Arts and Letters and my fellow alumni, I wish you success, however you choose to define it, and all the best for the years ahead. Congratulations to your families and to you. Thank you. I now call on the Associate Dean for Undergraduate Studies, Mary Flannery, to present the baccalaureate candidates who will receive a diploma. Will the candidates who will receive their diplomas as evidence of the baccalaureate degree please rise? Dean Mastillo, these students have successfully fulfilled the requirements of the College of Arts and Letters. With the approval of the faculty, they are now presented to you to receive evidence of the baccalaureate degree. Earlier today, President Jenkins by exercising the authority of the trustees of the University of Notre Dame, legally vested by the people of the state of Indiana, and upon the recommendation of the faculty, conferred upon each of you who have fulfilled stated requirements the appropriate baccalaureate degree with all the rights, privileges, duties, and responsibilities of that degree. As evidence of this achievement, you will receive appropriate recognition with your diploma. Please be seated. I invite the faculty ushers to escort students who have earned baccalaureate degrees to the platform.
Jake Ryan Abels. Leah Acri. David Michael Adams. Kelly Ann Adams. Julia Teresa Agostino. Maria Graciela Aguilon de la Maza. Elizabeth Mary Algair. Enzo Tecumseh Ambrose. Olivia Jean Anderson. Devin Apollon. Jared J. Appleby Adenran. Sabrina Aragon. Miranda K. Arendt. Natalie May Armbruster. Claire Elizabeth Hokeshi Armstrong. Jafar Armstrong. Colin Spencer Assam. Kylie Marine Atkins. Patricia Lynn Atkins. Stephen Joseph Ayers. Therese Lindsay Azimar. Kate C. Bailey. Onalea Gorata Batlotli. Aaron Banks. Marcella Victoria Bacarizzo Coelho. Christian Isaac Verona. Ross Barber. Olivia Kira Bernard. Ravon Taylor Barnes. Peter Albert Baranowski. Luke Sullivan Barrett. Emerald Layla Barthelme. Colleen Ann Bartlett. Bailey Ava Bombeck. Ryan Andrew Beebe. Catherine M. Velasky. Aaron Philip Benavidez. Tarek Fuad Bendik Saba. David Paul Bender. Matthew Henry Benson. Matthew 
Mary Elizabeth Benz. David William Berg. Jacob Matthew Burning. Spencer Daniel Bindell. Andrew Biondo. Allison Willoughby Blanchard. Leah Cameron Blitzer. Molly Elizabeth Boehner. <laughs> Levi Matthew Bognar. <laughs> Elise Marie Bolt. <laughs> Madison Lane Bollenbacher. Julian Stevenson Bonds. Colleen Elizabeth Bontrager. Jesse Nicole Bordelio. Kelby Cole Bosma. Christina Bato Bata Pardo. Clark Douglas Bowden. Alan Michael Robert Boyd. Brendan Gabriel Bradley. Patrick James Brady. Tim Brower. Teresa Marie Breckler. Talia Claire Calvin Brierly. Emily Fitzgerald Brigham. Harrison Scott Brousseau. Ethan Samuel Brown. Catherine Mary Brown. Peter Edward Brown. Gretchen Marie Bruning. John Francis Bruner. Jason Giovanni Brutacco. Robert Alexander Brutvan. Daniel Kelly Brick. Manuela Burbano Perez. Margaret Grace Burns. Ryan Matthew Burns. <laughs> Carolyn Quinn Butler. <laughs> Colin Bennett Campbell. <laughs> Gustavo Campoli Piano. <laughs> Sarah
Samuel Joseph Canova. Timothy Arnold Cantway II. Curry Booker Coupel. John David Carney. Bailey Cartwright. Natalie Grace Cassell. Joseph Nicholas Casamassima. Michelle Casas. Patrick Thomas Caslin. Ashley Conchetta Atanucci Cavuto. Alexandra Elizabeth Champlin. Heather Lynn Christman. Jake Monaco Camino. William Reagan Cole. James Bruce Compton. Thomas Anthony Connor. Carolyn Therese Cooper. Una Patricia Cooper. Brendan Joseph Kopp. Drew Kaur. Abby Christina Curry. Shamar Verde Cousin. Caitlin Marie Cox. Mary Catherine Crawford. Allison Elizabeth Croucher. Elizabeth Mary Cummings. Bryce Frederick Donkey. Shannon Kathleen Daly. Lydia Elizabeth Damus. Cecilia Dolores Damour. Thomas Dang. August Michael Darrow. John Terence Darrow. Divine Avery Davis. Lane Francis Davison. Grace Olivia Dean. Ana Lucia Del Valle Cardenas. Isabella Delgado Castillo. E. Weston Dell. Derek Joseph Delisola. Yes, 
August Thomas Desch. Zoe Thornton Desch. Allison Patricia DeRozier. Alexa F. DeVito. Laura McKenna DeVito. Juliana Di Bono. Isabella Di Bono Becerra. Shek Algasimu Diallo. Len Ann Din. Matilda Joanna Domohovska Lipska. Julia Marie Dodig. Jonathan Clayton Durer. Lena Marie Dominella. Charles Evans Donnelly. Edwin Vincent Donnelly. Marie Keishan Donnelly. Lindsay Ann Dorincott. Margaret Patricia Dosh. Grace Marie Darty. Therese Marie Douglas. Emma Downing. Aaron McAteer Doyle. Marie Elizabeth Doyle. Sean Porig Doyle. John Eli Draves. Brianna Janelle Drummond. Kyle J. Duffy. Christina Dulal. Brianna Sullivan Dusling. Michaela Deborah Eccles. <laughs> Teresa Eileen Eckle. <laughs> Jaina Ann Eckert. <laughs> Isabel Ann Edgar. Emily Grace Eagle. Charlotte Jane Edmonds. Alejandro Michael Edwards.
Brendan John Egan. Isabel M. Elizondo. Maya Elizabeth Elliott. Caroline Olivia Elser. John Porig Emery. Catherine Kennett Earhart. Christian Thomas Escherich. Maria Elena Esteve. Retta Lee Eubanks. Elliot Cooper Evans. Emily Parker Evans. Gabriele Nicole Evans. Michael William Everett. Keely Catherine Ewart. Darnell Famas Ewell. Connell Fagan. Jack Clancy Farron. Daniel Patrick Feldman. Caitlin Bernie Fennelly. Emma Kiner Ferdinandi. Hannah Pike Ferrero. Matthew Thomas Fessler. Margaret Mary Finger. Caroline B. Fish. Leah Grace Fitter. Mary Reagan Fitzgerald. Catherine Rose Flanagan. Paul Christopher Fleming. Madeline Dubois Foley. Anthony R. Fornash. Erica K. Forbes. Molly Elizabeth Ford. Tuesday, Laura Ford. Kevin Joseph Fox. Caroline Healy Freeman. Stephen Frick. Mary Kathleen Futer. Yeah. 
Noah Anthony Forneri. Sarah Grace Galbensky. Claire E. Gallagher. Eleanor Louise Gamble. Christopher Alexander Gamboa. Clementine Gabriele Mary Ganley. Andrew McCaffrey Gannon. Renyang Gao. Iris Natalia Garcia Barnett. Elizabeth Otto Gardy. Bridget McAllister Garrity. Patrick Daniel Gary. Thomas Joseph Garvey. Julia Seng Gately. Margaret Mary Gavigan. Carolyn Ann Guillen. Isabel Williams Giese. Ellen Catherine Geyer. David Lloyd Gersh. Griffin James Gilday. Nicholas James Godfrey. Camille Marie Geffels. Julia Nell Goldschmidt. Ariana Nicole Gomez. Desi Christina Gomez. Jacques Alexander Gonard. Odalis Janeth Gonzalez Reyes. Jacob Allen Gorman. Marin McKenna Gorman. Christopher Michael Gotwako. Alejandro Fernando Graham Stathagen. Elijah Joseph Grammer. Mariana Grandmont. Anne Matthews Greer. Anne Marie Francine Gregory. Edward Reed Gregory. Yeah. 
Brandon Greer. Houston Kyle Griffith. Isabel Marie Grogan. Joanna Gross. Emily Rose Groth. Sienna Marie Gruller. Antonio Luis Guerra. Olivia Angela Gunton. Mauricio Guzman Hinoza. Sydney Haberman. Helena Alexandra Hadi. John Patrick Hale. Lily Catherine Halleck. John Owen Hanley. Charles Lewis Hansel. Faith Valerie Harris. Shante Jade Harris. Abigail Marie Hayes. Margaret Kathleen Healy. Ingrid Navarre Heimer. Martin David Haley. Noah Scott Helm. Abigail Ruth Helm. Jordan Hunter Helmcomb. Kenzie Lee Hanksbull. Sophia Hen. Amaret Beatriz Hernandez. Laura Hernandez. Robert J. Hernandez. Francisco Hernandez Guzman. Evan Lowell Hess. Maria Alexandra Heber. Aaron M. Eastand. Colleen Mary Hoden. Kirsten Savon Elizabeth Hogan. Sarah Christina Holland. Ochran Dayton Holloway Jr. Nicholas Gadala Holmes. 
Abigail Grace Halston. Megan Elizabeth Holsbar. Gabriella Marie Hong. Margaret Catherine Haran. William Thomas Hornby. Michael Soren Horvath. Declan Francis Hoter. Megan Lee Howitt. Thomas James Huber. Catherine Renee Huffert. Abigail Suzanne Hughes. Rachel Catherine Hughes. Carter Benjamin Hult. Eva Therese Herm. Patrick Riley Herman. Sarah Margaret Ulisic. Rachel Michelle Ingle. Mika D. Inouye. Regis Israhenda. Ryan Franklin Israel. Reagan Jean Jacobs. John Bradley Jagubowski. Clay Richard Jaskowski. Grace Elizabeth Johannesson. David Samuel Wallace Johnson. Emma Marie Jones. Thank you both so much. Sorry, only half of you get to graduate today. Uh, at this point, I am pleased to introduce you to the arts and letters version of the seventh inning stretch. Uh, we have to you know, get, shift the diplomas around for the next group. Um, so what I'd like to do is ask various groups of students to stand up and be recognized, as many of them have earned academic honors or have participated uh, in activities and events that are noteworthy. Before we do that, we'd like to show you a brief video of just a few of our seniors reflecting on their time here at Notre Dame and in the College of Arts and Letters. I had always heard Notre Dame was a great school, great community. My mother was looking for schools and she told me, oh, there's this very nice Catholic school up north that you should try to go check out. Then I came and I just fell in love I remember getting the letter and I was overjoyed, okay. really well, excited. I was really passionate about the on, liberal arts education uh, that was offered, knowing that I wanted to plan. use that to make a difference upon graduation and kind of give back to my community.
The value of a liberal arts education is that you see these residences and these echoes in all of the different classes that you take. I have always been a really curious person. A liberal arts education nourishes all of those curiosities and helps me to be a better citizen of the uh, world. With a, a GPA of 3.955 or higher. Congratulations. Will the following students now each stand in turn? Those of you who earned academic department awards or honors. Those of you who have been selected for induction into Phi Beta Kappa, please stand. Students who studied abroad, please stand. <laughs> Those of you who did service work, please stand. For those of you who have committed to continue in full-time service after graduation, please stand. Would all of the students who participated in the ROTC program please stand and we thank you for your service. Would you please stand if you won an internal or external grant or fellowship? If you've had your writing published in a magazine or a journal. Who took part in an internship? Well done. Who played in an orchestra, one of the bands, or another music group? Or sang in a choir or ensemble? Who performed in one of our theater productions? And who showed your art in an exhibition or gallery? Will all of those who participated in a varsity sport please stand? Would those of you who participated in a club sport please stand? And now, for whatever reason, will those of you who pulled an all-nighter please stand? Thank you. Today we honor all of these tired graduates for their hard work and accomplishments, but they did not make the journey alone. Would all the faculty here today who taught, advised, or mentored these undergraduates at one time or another please stand and be recognized. And now, will the parents, guardians, grandparents, spouses, brothers, sisters, other family members, and friends stand or raise your hands so that our graduates can thank you for your long and loving support that got them to this moment. And it sounds like we will now have the video. I had always heard Notre Dame was a great school, a great community. My mother was looking for schools and she told me, oh, there's this very nice Catholic school up north that you should try to go check out. Then I came and I just fell in love. I remember getting the letter and I was overjoyed, really excited. I was really passionate about the liberal arts education that was offered, knowing that I wanted to use that to make a difference upon graduation and kind of give back to my community.
The value of a liberal arts education is that you see these residences and these echoes in all of the different classes that you take. I have always been a really curious person. A liberal arts education nourishes all of those curiosities and helps me to be a better citizen of the world, a better thinker and writer. Communication skills, engaging in discussion, and appreciating different viewpoints on a topic. It's all about learning about yourself and getting a better understanding of the world. It just provides me with a more well-rounded background. So I'm just like poverty and inequality, it prepares you with the tools to make a difference. So I think it goes well with Notre Dame's mission of being a force for good in the world. Liberal arts help me discern the direction I want my life to go. Taking my interests and gifts and figuring out how I can best use those to serve those around me. I would never have found what I wanted to do without a liberal arts education. The conversations I've had with other students, with professors, so many cool opportunities. I can't imagine any other way. Notre Dame will always hold a special place in my heart now. It's definitely like a second home. Oh, I'm so happy that I came to Notre Dame. I would never change that for the world. The thing that I love most is the community. There's a lot of people rooting for you at this school. That's something that, you know, I'll carry with me. I have this home and these people that totally support me no matter what. I'm definitely gonna miss Notre Dame. It's exciting to see, I guess, where I'll go from here. We will now present diplomas to the second half of our graduating class of 2021. I invite the ushers to escort the remaining students who have earned baccalaureate degrees to the platform to receive their diplomas. Luke Matthew Jones. Micah Edward Jones. Parker Jones. Bentley Jose. Cassandra M. Joins. Franz Theodore Macabonti Huacala. Grace Margaret Kaiser. John Christopher Kaplan. Liam Thomas Gaylord Carr. Jane Louise Kasabian. Stephen Paul Kowalis. Brittany Lee Keen Murphy. Anna Sophia Keller.
Adam Alexander Keys Jr. Annika Kamani. Anthony Mendoza Kies. Scott John Kiley. Dane Kim. Gavin Douglas King. Matthew Daniel Kirchmeyer. Catherine P. Kleiser. John Dennis Kling. Koki Kobayashi. Kelly Anna Conan. Taylor Andrea Kohler. Sophia Ku. Sydney Elizabeth Kraft. Madison Taylor Kranz. Gabriel Loris Crutt. William Quang. Noelle Marie Cadelco. Audrey Wang Kurtz. Jameson Daniel Labadee. Agatha Ann LeBeau. Maria Helga Elizabeth Lake. Philip Carl Lolly. William Michael Lamara. Vanessa Michael Lamoretti. Maxwell McLeish Lander. Mitchell John Larson. Elizabeth Grace Lasecki. Sophia Therese Lauber. Kaya Angelica Yolanda Lawrence. Emmanuel C. Lazaro. Michelle Lee. Brady Lefkowitz. McKenna Rose Ligurski. Joseph Anthony Lembo. Caroline Virginia Leonard. Pierce Charles Lewin. Molly Elizabeth Link. Ethan Michael Lipnicki. Alexa Joe Longstaff. Anna Victoria Lopez. Theodore Patrick Lopez Jr. Jack and James Luck. Caitlin Saskia La 
Lumsden. James Calistro Lynch. Michael Anthony Lynch. John Francis Lyons. Sean Patrick Lyons. Christy Miller McClary. Kenneth Charles McDonald. Mitchell Francis McDonald. Cade Allen McQuarrie. Emma Catherine McGinn. Claudia Ann Catherine Magnuson. James David Mahoney. Catherine Faye Malik. Vincent Patrick Mallet. Disha Malpure. Emma Martika Mengels. Veronica Grace Monsour. Ravan Mekbul. Ori Matthew Marciano. Michael Anthony Marota. Riley McKeon Marsh. Alexandra Lisbeth Martinez. Isabella Kealoha Martinez. Madeline Rose Martinez. Ian Wade Marks. Noah Joseph Matapalo. Gwendolyn Marie Mattingly. Jacqueline Irene Matoni. Sawyer Alexander May. Ryan Patrick McArdle. Elizabeth Ann McCabe. Jack Tyler McCabe. Kyle Robert McCabe. Patrick Hidalgo McCabe. Eleanor Ann McCarthy. Rachel Noel McLean. Sean Thomas McConville. Megan Rose McCormick. Grace Marie McDermott. Emily Elizabeth McDowell. Meredith Elizabeth McElroy. Kayla Marie McFarland. Ooh. 
Marissa Colleen McFarlane. Alyssa Hope McGrath. Patrick Riley McGuire. Madeline S. McLaughlin. Patrick Sullivan Walsh McMonagall. Ryan Patrick McNellis. Emily Marie Mira. Kyle Patrick Mettler. Sarah Patricia Meyer. Muhammad Abukar Mian. Michael Francis Minji. Aelani Marie Mitchell. Courtney Claire Mitchell. Catherine Ann Mollenkopf. Alexander Michael Moran. Catherine Cecilia Moran. Allison Patricia Morcus. Anna Cecilia Morajon. Dajane Neri Mosley. Eileen Marie Mostyn. Jasmine M. Morosek. Katie Ann Mullane. Evan Bryce Muller. Catherine Alice Mulshine. Nicholas Isaiah Mungin. Allison Marie Murphy. Bridget Elizabeth Murphy. James Murphy. Joanna Marie Murphy. Margaret Ann Murphy. Shannon McCarthy Murphy. Thomas Sullivan Murphy. Alexandria Murray. Hannah Ann Murray. Thomas Joseph Murray II. Bruce Martin Knockfor III. Louis Christopher Nani. Daryl Anthony Nakan Jr. Jacob Evan Nicewander. Irene Elizabeth Newman. Brianna Lee Niemöller. Gabriel Jacob Niferatos. Logan Elizabeth No. Woo! 
Meredith Therese Nowatarski. Evan Fortes Nunez. Andrew Berkeley Obear. Daniel Parker O'Brien. Ellen Warner O'Brien. Kathleen Elizabeth O'Brien. OVP's Ogafu. Catherine Sarah O'Leary. Megan Eileen O'Leary. Teresa Mary Olahan. Brennan Lorraine O'Malley. Mary Christine O'Reilly. Keegan Mary O'Toole. Patrick James O'Toole. Connor Charles Ott. Angela Marie Overlock. Jeremiah Ernest Oasua Koromara Yaw. Grace Mary Palmer. Ria Ashi Parik. Da Young Park. Augustine Passen. Noah Daniel Passano. Eleanor Grace Patton. Maria Luisa Paul Rangel. Catherine Elizabeth Paulson. Zachary Charles Pearson. Hallie K. Pellegrin. Madeline Oliva Penn. Catherine McCoy Perry. Akila Person. Susan Catherine Peters. Andrew Michael Peterson. David Jonathan Phillips. Tess Elizabeth Phillips. Marie Elizabeth Picconi. Ellen Pill. Annalisa Pines. Richard John Panola III. Pewis. 
Laura Pewis Hanaras. Marissa Joan Plant. Jorge Andres Plaza. Anne Maria Plecky. Mary Catherine Porath. Andrew Francis Powers. Zoe Lynn Prendergast. Benjamin Gerald Samuel Price. Sarah Elizabeth Price. Tonasia Divine Price. Sean Fitzpatrick Prusen. Cheyenne Pryor. Elizabeth Grace Pontillo. Molly Elizabeth Queel. Matthew Frederick Quinn. Claire Bridget Rafford. Kate Booty Reagan. Omar Ramirez Borrego. Chad Jeremy Ramos. Megan Teresa Raster. Jessica Lynn Rieg. Claire McCarthy Reed. Margaret Mary Reisel. Anastasia Marie Reisinger. Claire Christina Reitan. Madison Bailey Restivo. Amanda Elizabeth Raymer. Emily Grace Reynolds. Diego Armando Reynoso. Natalie Elizabeth Reysa. Christina Maria Rabira. William Christopher Richard. Ellis Antonio Rojas. Maria Christine Ritten. Christopher Dakota Rivers. Thomas Andrew Dello Robbins. John Arthur Robinson IV. Catherine Suzanne Robinson. Constantine Elena Rodriguez. Sophia Eloisa Rodriguez. Simon Renoki.
John, Edward John Rogan. Anne Marie Romano. Patrick Rosinski. Christopher Michael Ross. Daniel Nicholas, Nicholas Roddenborn. Laura Grace Rubino. Nicole, Nicolette Taylor Ruiz. Mariah Rush. Jessica Elise Russell. Brooke Collins Sabi. Matthew Wayne Saad. Lucretia Salviario Udleu. Camila Salcedo Espetita. Daphne Solumi. Nicholas Trower Sanford. Wheelan Sang. Hannah Elizabeth Euland. Courtney Nicole Sauter. Maylin Victoria Scanish. Frederick Joseph Schemmel. Madeline Rosemary Shearl. Margaret Eileen Schlick. Charlotte Marie Schmidt. Megan M. Schmidt. Sebastian Harold Hans Schmidt. Isabella Sophia Schmidt. John Joseph Schmitz. Megan Lauren Schutzen. Leo Felix Schwarzkopf. Robert Edward Scott. Charles Nicholas Sador. Philippe Tomas Segura. Kristen Marie Seidler. Reagan Bates Cernal. Maureen Danielle Shacklett. Josephine Louise Shaw. Emma Caroline Shea. Thomas P. Sheehan. Sophia Maria Sheehy. Mackenzie Irene Scheel.
Amy E. Shields. Carly Jospel Seifker. Augustine Bernard Siegel. Andrew C. Sigular. Timothy Francis Silva, Jr. Maeve Therese Simon. Nicole Marie Simon. Joseph Stephan Simon. Daniela Sophia Simons Arango. Jack Andrew Satarski. Anne Teresa Slevin. Matthew Edward Sloan. Dominique Michelle Smith. Jameer Bernard Smith. Megan Catherine Smith. Riley Danielle Smith. Victoria Smith. William Thomas Soggy. Elizabeth Grace Solar. Shajing Song. Josiah Daniel Spencer. William Henry Spreadjack. Caitlin and Steenvorden. Sophia Marie Stefanovsky. Mariella Isabel Stevens. Bailey Dawn Stewart. Elizabeth Marie Stratton. Andrew Jerome Sullivan. Callie Cecile Sullivan. Jillian Elizabeth Sullivan. Cameron Coyle Sumner. Matthew Bernard Switek. Rachel Sarah Tanksos. Michelle Ai Tap. Brianna Ines Tello. Sydney Sierra Thielen. Ali Abdul Thomas Jr. Hannah Marie Thompson. (laughs) 
Emily Elizabeth Tai. Hannah Marie Toner. Naomi Ava Torosatsky. Christina Yvette Torres. Jennifer Ray Torres. Christian V. Torcell. Catherine Marjorie Tracy. Mary Elizabeth Tracy. Matthew Tam Trin. Valentina Quan Trombetta. Malik S. Trope. Cynthia Truillo. Christopher James Sevis. William Tumblaka. Joshua Stephen Turk. Matthew John Torgoski. John Donald Usher. Nathaniel Van Duthala. Courtney Marie Van Huffel. Adrian Jose Varela Castillo. Gabriela Vargas Severio. Michaela Virgie Vaughn. Ryan Anthony Vaza. Killian Theodore Vidorek. Angela Rose Vidicic. Antonio Viegas Jimenez. Samuel Volz. Mylin Liwa Vondrasic. Stephen Gregory Vukovic. Benjamin Wainscott. Andres Walliser Wehebe. Sophie Angel Waltrip. Xiu Wang. Reagan Elizabeth Ward. Lauren Taylor Watts. Nikayla Marie Webster. Rachel Corinne Webby. Kyle William Jonathan Weingartner. Alexander Corrigan Weishen. Danielle Renee Welch.
Anna Elizabeth Wellen. Claire Ann Whalen. Victoria Eileen Whitmore. Ezekiel Joseph Wiguto. Melissa Marie Wilkie. Brooke Marie Williams. Leanne Marie Williams. Eric Charles Winnegar. Antonella Lucia Wing Vargas. Abigail Grace Wolf. Robert B. Wong III. Eleanor Lute Wood. Jadrian Woods. Haley Christine Wooten. Olivia A. Wright. Lynette Marie Wookie. Zachary Masayuki Yamada. Emily Evelyn Yeager. Yan Chung Natalie Ying. Lauren Yu. Stephanie Ann Zacone. Serena M. Zacharias. Peter Zajikowski Yule. Mary Evelyn Zakowski. Juliana Michelle Zeff. Atina Zhang. Robert Thomas Siegler. Let us once again applaud our newest alumni. Congratulations. Before the benediction, I would like to thank the band for their wonderful performance under the direction of Dr. Kenneth Dye and led by Matthew Mer Merton and Sam Sanchez. I would also like to thank the stadium staff and ushers who helped us organize this event. I'd like to thank the staff from the registrar's office for their tireless efforts to help organize our college diploma ceremony as well as the university commencement ceremony this morning. And finally, I thank as well the faculty and staff of the College of Arts and Letters for helping with this ceremony. We could not have had this ceremony without all of these volunteers.
Now I'd like to invite Odalis Gonzalez to offer the benediction. She is a graduating senior from American Falls, Idaho, who majored in psychology with a supplementary major in Latino studies and a minor in education, schooling, and society. Some of her classmates will join her to lead us in singing our alma mater, Notre Dame Our Mother. The words are located inside your program booklet on page 45. And finally, so that we have a somewhat of an orderly exit at the end of the alma mater, I ask that faculty and students follow the guidance of the ushers to your exit. Please stand now and remain standing after the benediction. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Merciful Lord, we stand before you in gratitude for all the gifts you have bestowed upon us. We thank you for our beloved ones who are joining us today, both in person and virtually. We are grateful for the beautiful day we have awoken to. Thanks be to you for walking with us throughout our years at this glorious university that bears your mother's name. Today, we begin the next chapter of our lives, and we recognize the hardship that comes with transitions. The future is filled with uncertainties, fears, and hardships. Nonetheless, we trust that you will guide us through the next years as you have always done. For you have called us by name. You know each and every one of us. Your Holy Spirit rests with us as we are made in the likeliness of your image, my God. Lord, we ask that we may always remember we are your children. And as your children, we are called to a purpose greater than ourselves. May we always continue to love one another and help each other in our time of need as you call us to do. We ask that you open our hearts and minds to that which we may not understand. For that is where you lay. I ask you, Mary, Madre de todas madres, Madre de mi gente, that you may continue to watch over us as we walk away from the beautiful golden dome upon which you rest. May we continue to transform and by your grace, God, fulfill our calling. We ask this through your son, Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever, amen. Reina de los cielos, ruega por nosotros. Thanks be to God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Thank you.